Good day everybody, in today's tutorial I'm going to be showing you how to use the tab functionality in Adobe Illustrator to create um, simple lists. Now, first thing you have to do is create your text container, so use the type tool and drag and drop and get yourself a text row. Anyways, Anyways I already have some text laid out right here and for the sake of this tutorial, you could do copy paste whatever text you find around. Um, I found this on a website. So, but I want to make this a list. Sadly, there's no quick list generator in Adobe Illustrator, as far as I can tell. So you have to manually insert the number one, the two, three, four, or the dots. So let's uh, let's do that. So I'm going to put one right here. Two. Add you know, space three and add the four there. Now, as you can see, all these lists right here items are double lined, and this does not look nice having the three and the dash right underneath to one. So, best way to fix that is the tab functionality. So, all you have to do is go to window, go to type. And click to on tabs. Shortcut is Shift Control T on Windows on a Mac. I believe it'd be Command uh, Command Shift and T. All right. Once you click that, you get the tab window, and you just click right here, which will attach the tab window to your a text uh, box right here. So it makes it a lot easier. Now there's four different types of tabs. There's Left justify tabs, center justify tab, right justify tab, and decimal justify tab. They all work similar, 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 uh, different functionality. So test it out on your own time. I'll just be using the left justify tab. So what we're gonna do is line it up with the T right here and let go. Now go to the three and click press tab. Also, sometimes when you're pressing a tab, uh, pressing once doesn't always work, so you have to do a quick uh, double tap. Um, anyways, that's it for this tutorial. I hope you enjoyed it, and if you have any questions, then leave a comment. Thank you.